This is a performance focused take on the classic oscillator circuits that can be found in the uh, Memory Moog and the Profit 5 based on the uh, 3340 chip. It's got three waveform outputs, the triangle, square and ramp is the triangle. The ramp. And the square. So the module can act as an audio frequency oscillator or a low frequency oscillator and you choose that with this little slidey switch here. In audio frequency mode this frequency pot here spans two octaves so you've got one octave going down and one octave going up and it's detented in the middle so you can feel it slot into place and you know it's in tune and you can set that tune in with the master tune trim pot, which is hidden inside this leftmost CV jack. That's set with this little screwdriver that's included with the module, and you just put it in there. You don't have to take the whole module out just to tune it. In low frequency mode, this pot spans the entire range of the oscillator, all the way down from very, very slow, about four seconds per cycle, up to audio rate, and uh, you can push that further positively or negatively with the CV input. To get an idea of how slow it can go, let's plug the square wave into this relay here. So that's the start of the cycle. And that's the end of the cycle. One of the defining features of the module is this octave switch at the top here. It's got four positions, and let's have a listen to that. And that octave switch is really useful in the low frequency mode as well, because you can use it like a kind of clock divider multiplier. If I plug the LFO from this module into the VCA here that's controlling the volume of this oscillator, you'll hear that. That's the triangle wave coming out of here, modulating the CV on the VCA. And if I play with the octave switch, Because it's one volt per octave tuned, it doubles in frequency. And there are two CV inputs, which is really cool because you don't have to use an external mixer to patch in some vibrato or something. Here we go. We haven't talked yet about the pulse width modulation input. Uh, when there's nothing plugged into it, the square wave is at a 50% duty cycle. Uh, let's plug something in and have a listen. Thank <laughs> you. 